what is the ingredients to keeping that love alive, to staying together, and to having successful marriage? What is the ingredients? You have to have really amazing sex. That's it. See, I told you. I told you. I told you. If you ain't fucking the level, I see where this is going. No, 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 Swiss. No, no, no. Let it, let it go. Don't say nothing, cuz. Finish, finish this up. So I think that you definitely have to really know how to treat the person that you love and you have to satisfy them on multiple levels. You have to satisfy them physically. It's mm-hmm. true. You have to satisfy them emotionally. You have to be able to find each other in emotional space too. Mm-hmm. So like if you, you, you more emotional, I'm, I'm, pe- I'm pegging you as emotional. He's sensitive. Words, right? He's sensitive. Like, I like that about you, but mm-hmm. you have to be able to meet the person in their emotional space. Cause if you don't understand each other, then that, that's not going to go well. And then you have to emotionally and spiritually, like be able to be compatible. You know, it's, it's like, we are very compatible, even though you wouldn't think so. He likes when I'm me and I like when he's him. <sighs> It's communication, but it's also confidence, mm. self-confidence. Like a lot of guys are not prepared for strong women. Mm. Mm. Talk about that I understand part. a lot of guys are not prepared oh. for a strong woman. And what we have is she's her boss, I'm my boss. She has her own accountants, I have my own accountants. Oh. We live our life as our own bosses, but when we come together, we create you know, the love. 